Hi guys, and welcome to Undercover Scam Beta. I met this romance scammer Jocelyn Kate on Facebook. She is one of the most clueless scammers I've ever dealt with. She couldn't even remember where she lives. Not only that, she was relentless when it came to asking for gift cards. In the original scam bait, she asked for gift cards over 30 times, but I've removed most of these so this video isn't repetitive. Thank you for taking the time to watch this video, and I hope that you enjoyed as much as I did wasting this scammer's time. How are you doing, dear? Good. How are you? I am good. Where do you live? USA. How about you? Florida. What do you do for work? I am hookup and you? You are a hookup? Yes. What about you? I'm retired. You got Cash App? I can get you 7k same day and you gonna send 2k when it hit. I don't need your login info, I'll just tell you what to do. And please, I don't want any MFs who run off with cuts. I want all my <laughs> eating 100. Can I trust you with my cut? WTF are you talking about? Do you have cash app? Do you have a brain? Yes, why ask? This, it makes no sense. Okay, tell me something. I sometimes daydream about topless sunbathing with the elderly. Okay, that's good. Why do you keep asking me about Cash App? Lazily, Jocelyn sends me the same cut and paste nonsense without any improvements in grammar. Don't you understand English? Do you understand grammar? Yes. You obviously don't, judging by this mess. Where do you live? California. How about you? Same. Wow, how long have you lived in California? Three years. Interesting, because you told me you lived in Florida. My grandma lives in Florida. Why did you say you lived there? I live with my grandma. Do you live in Florida or California? I live in California and my grandma live in Florida. You told me you live with your grandma. Your grandma lives in Florida. Yes, I'm at California now. Where in California or Florida do you live? Nevada. I don't think you know where you live. What are you saying? Nevada is a state. So you fail in grammar and geography. Yes. What? But why are you asking me all this question about where I live? I hope dear is no problem. You should be able to tell me where you live, unless you are a child. I am not a child. Okay, put on your big girl pants and tell me where in Nevada you live. Do you live in those mountains? No. Jocelyn sends me a stolen photo of adult entertainer Carolina Suki to prove that she's not a child. I'm still not convinced. Carolina has an extensive presence on the internet and large followings on sites such as TikTok, Twitter, Fansly and OnlyFans. Which works are you doing? I was a professional hopscotch player. What is hopscotch? It's an amazing sport with hopping, rocks and turning. Okay. I'm surprised you haven't heard of it before. I played in the NHA, National Hopscotch Association. What have you been doing today? Have been cleaning house. What about you? I've been counting how many fingers and toes I have. Do you have a girlfriend? No. Okay. Don't you mean I am your girlfriend? Where are you living today? Why do you want to know? So I can stalk you? Okay, stalk me. What do you want to talk about? I need something from you. What's that? Can you go to the store? Yes, I'm an adult, unlike you, and I can go to the store anytime I like. Okay, so when are you going, dear? Going where? To the store. I don't need to go to the store. I have enough adult diapers to last me six months. Can you please help me get the card, baby? I will be more appreciative. Help me get it tomorrow, baby. Just any amount you can afford. What card? You didn't ask me for a card. I need an Apple gift card, please. I beg your pardon. Will you get that for me tomorrow, please? Nobody needs an Apple gift card. I kindly need that to subscribe for a kid game. I knew you were a child. No, I want to use the Apple card to subscribe for my aunt's kids game. Tell your aunt to buy her own Apple gift card. She isn't around. Can't you be of help? Give me her contact details and I will tell her myself. Oh, what do you mean? Just because I ask you for a gift card, you hear telling me trash. This is crazy giving you her number. 
For what? Give me your aunt's contact details and I will tell her to buy her own gift card. Okay. I see you aren't serious with me for once. I'm very serious. You are not. What would you like to talk about? About the gift card. Can you go to the store today? I want to do Soprias for her. So that is I need the gift card. Soprias isn't a real word, babe. Can you afford me $20? Yes, I can afford $20. Okay, thanks. Why are you thanking me? I just said that I can afford it. I'm not buying it. I am not good at all. Why is that, dear? You are the one. What do you mean? I need you. Why do you need me, dear? I need the gift card. Buy your own gift card. I don't know where I can get it. Can you just help me out? You can buy them online or at a department store. Can you afford me $20 to buy it online? Or you should go to the store and get it? You should go to the store and buy it. Can you afford me $20 to go to the store and get it? I can afford it, but I don't give money to strangers. I am a stranger. I am your girlfriend. You aren't my girlfriend. So why can't you afford it for me? I can afford it, but I don't give money to strangers. Hmm, but you said I am your girlfriend. No, I never said that. Sometimes in online relationships, a complete stranger can believe that they are your girlfriend, even though you've never stated they are. In this imaginary romantic relationship, you'll be expected to purchase gift cards for games. Games for her, and also games for her aunt's kids. In the end, it is best to get the aunt's contact details, so you can tell her yourself to buy her own damn gift cards. Thank you for watching Undercover Scam Beta. Please like, subscribe and hit the bell icon to get notifications of our new videos.